and the Queen's eldest son will now take over the throne. Today the crown passes, as it has done for more than a thousand years, to our new monarch, our new head of state, His Majesty King Charles III. With the King's family, we mourn the loss of his mother. We offer him our loyalty and devotion, just as his mother devoted so much to so many for so long. And with the passing of the second Elizabethan age, we usher in a new era in the magnificent history of our great country, exactly as Her Majesty would have wished, by saying the words, God save the King. That was the UK's new Prime Minister, Liz Truss, on her support the for the newly crowned King Charles III. The new monarch and his three siblings were by their mother's side when she died. Prince William is now the new heir apparent. And Governor David Ige has ordered flags to be flown at half-staff immediately until sunset the, on the day of Queen Elizabeth's burial, which is expected to play, take place 10 days from now. The state of Hawaii joining the rest of the world in mourning the loss of Queen Elizabeth II.